it's, it's huge because they've, they've had a knack for kind of coming back later in the game. And, um, you know, they battled, they battled the whole game and the, and the whole game and they just kind of put together good bats the whole game and then eventually kind of break through. So for me, it's, it's understanding two runs, probably not lose that game today. You just go out there and try to compete and try to throw strikes and let the defense work and, and um, try to go as deep as I could in the game. Seems like we ask you about Frankie almost every time you pitch. You ever get tired of talking about that guy? No, I do not. I do not get tired of that. He makes the routine plays and he makes the great plays. So, um, you know, he takes pride in it. He works hard at it. So, I mean, um, he expects that of himself. And um, that's what the good players do. So he's he's definitely put himself on that pedestal and expects it from him. So he keeps working at it. He's probably going to keep making those plays. Uh, speak to the special player that he is. He makes the bare hand play. That he comes up with the, the go ahead home run too. Right, he doesn't just take pride in one side of the ball. He takes pride in both sides of the ball. It's what, to me, that's that man's what makes him such a dynamic player. Is he, he he works hard at his craft on the infield and he works hard at his craft on the mound. I mean, um, on the on the um, in the batter's box. So he doesn't take anything off. He doesn't take anything for granted. He goes up there and works his butt off, and, it, and you can see why he is the player he is.